Welcome to the Mob Squad, where we're just a group of friends talking about anything pop culture and band box related. I'm your host, Kevin. Joining me as always is Carrie. Yo. And Felix. I guess I'm here. <laughs> Wait, no, you're supposed to do what's up. <laughs> How about some mail call? Does anybody got any good mail? I do. I'm going to show him off. I picked this up the other day. It is venomized Superman, not venomized, I should say, infected Superman. This is a McFarland toys. No, it's Dude, not bizarre. That's, yeah, it's, it, that's pretty wicked. It's uh, from a recent storyline in uh, the comics where Superman has infected himself with uh, the same stuff that the Joker, who, the Batman who laughs, uses and just to try to get closer to the Batman who laughs to try to capture him. So, and that's what it turned out. So, McFarland Toys, awesome. right? I love the sculpt. Yeah. McFarland yeah. rocks, man. Dude, McFarland is killing it with the DC line. Absolutely killing it. That does it for Mail Call if no one else has anything. And we are going to move on into our personal top five favorite movie soundtracks. Which, for the That's record, was very, very hard. All right, we are going to start with our top five. five. So we're going to list our five, four, three, two, and then our favorite. Uh, I will start this off, if y'all don't mind. My okay. fifth favorite is the Lion King. Gotcha, okay. The soundtrack to the... Exactly, from that to I just don't want to be... It means no worries. I just don't want to be king, or I can't wait to be king. I can't I just wait, can't wait to, be king. to be king. Dude, I love that whole soundtrack. It's awesome. Uh, what was because it? Because maybe um, we saw it, you know, early in age, and that's like the one that stayed with us yeah I, I believe so I, I will say most of mine are fairly older movies they make you feel something they do you know I mean? they totally do you know if the soundtrack don't make you feel anything it's not a good movie in my opinion uh, Barry, what do you got my fifth is aladdin what disney i love disney like there's i mean it was so hard to make this list, but Aladdin's my number five. Be honest with you, it's probably in Kevin's too, but we're not going to get there. Disney was a big part of mine too. I'm like, mm -hmm. I, I, I only put it down to one though. I'm like, I'm going to have just one in my top five, and I couldn't do it. Couldn't do it. Staying with the Disney train, I would have to go with The Lion King. Yeah, oh, like see, what? mine. I had like the Lion King, Tarzan, toys or Toy Story up. I mean, it just I it, love it all goes... the Disney soundtracks. Mm -hmm. So to choose so, one was very difficult. Wow, I'm I'm surprised me and Felix actually agree on something for a change. <laughs> that don't, you can that be don't right. happen, you, people. You can. Well, be right. my fourth Couple was the Lion know. King, so. Yeah, yeah. All right, so Felix said his uh, fifth was The Lion King, so my number four is Aladdin. <laughs> <laughs> so I, listen, Aladdin to me it is my favorite Disney movie of all time. Um, a Whole New World, Friend Like Me, I mean, One Jump Ahead of the Bread Line. Uh, I, can, I love those songs. Yeah. It's, they're, to me, they're iconic. I could. I actually have the CD in my truck right now, uh, playing when I start my truck up. Uh, Carrie, how about you? What is your fourth? My number four is The Lion King. <laughs> well, our, so we kind of we're all, we were all kind of right there. I get yeah. it. I get it. I get yep. it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna be honest with you guys. We didn't compare notes beforehand, so this is kind of funny. 
No, it yeah, really it is, is kind of funny. <laughs> I, I I thought we were going to be completely different, and we might still be. But as we go, I fourth, think we will be. Oh, I'm sure yeah, we will be. As of right now, we're matching up, which is freaky. Um, Here is a shocker, it, though. I've never seen a lad in the cartoon or the movie. What? Wow, Sorry. Felix, you need to watch the freaking. Yeah. The maybe cartoon, was, Robin, we... Robin Williams, the genie. Oh, I love yeah. him. And yeah, maybe after Felix. the um, the Titanic watch along, we can do Aladdin. Aladdin, I'm down. I'm down, homie. No, no, no. We gotta do Ponyo first before we do Titanic and Aladdin. Oh, we Jesus made that Christ. agreement way months ago. So mm. <laughs> Ponyo. I... Shout out to Kevin's mm. mom. <laughs> I'm not opposed. And to moving on, Felix, what is your number four? <laughs> uh oh. Grease. Are you kidding me? Grease. Grease. Am I right? Uh, yes. Uh, hand jive, baby. Grease. Um, I was born a hand jive. Oh, yes, I love that love soundtrack, it. by the way. It didn't make that my list, awesome. but I love it. <laughs> um, th that Tell one, that, summer, <laughs> summer loving, um, summer loving. stranded at the driving, <laughs> branded oh. up. I saw the album of it. It opens up like this. It's beat up to hell and back. It's scratched up, but I still have my album from the eighties. Um, not only did you know we watch it as I as a kid a lot. In high school, we did a uh, musical theater, and I think I've already told you guys, but here we go again. We did the mm -hmm. old, uh, the montage. But I, I approached the teacher in beauty school dropout. I'm like, you know, because at that mo part of the montage, it was like a dance and sing type thing. The girls were going to be messing with girls' hair on beauty school dropout. Like, wouldn't it be funny if the guys came around, threw some wigs on, and the girls are tending to the guys while we sing? And then that one led into uh, Grease Lightning, I think. Long story short, he oh, bought it. And I, I got that recorded somewhere. If I ever find it, I'm going to throw it on there. But it's cool. Grease yeah, Lightning. It. You know, it's funny because it's <laughs> when I was little, my sister, when she was in high school, they did a Grease play. So they did all the, the musical numbers and stuff. And then when I gr grew up and then I watched the movie and I was like, oh, hey, I remember seeing my sister play that one part. And so I, I can totally be down for having Grease being in the top five. I'm actually so down for having Grease in the top five. It, five, it is my number three. Ooh. I am Are not kidding. kidding. I will show you. I will show you my <laughs> list when I'm done. It is on there as my number three. <laughs> oh, Grease man. Is my number three. Uh, it, my, my daughter loves this movie. I love this movie. Like you said, the soundtrack is just amazing. Uh, I think we've already said enough about it, so we'll, we'll move on from there. Carrie, what is your number three? Uh, my number three is A Star is Born, the, the one with uh, Lady Gaga. Okay. There were some pretty, okay. pretty heavy feeling songs in there that just kind of touched me. And so that's my number three. I've never seen that Carrie one. Got Carrie got touched. Carrie got touched. I got so, touched. And then uh, Felix, touched what is your soul. number three? <laughs> I don't even know where we're at. Uh, number three? Number three. Number three. Got to be The Little Mermaid. Oh, I and thought again, that'd be higher on your list. When I was in grade yeah, school. Yeah, I thought that'd be the higher too. When I was in grade school, we, uh, again, you guys know the story, but we did, uh, it, it's still there with me. I yeah, get you think you had just a plenty. It's in there. It's got to be a little more. I got food like to watch the glory. You want to say that? I got 20. My son's middle name is Sebastian, too, like the crabs, so. Nice. Cool, cool. cool. Can't hate on that, man. That's, mm -hmm. I mean, Little Mermaid, love it. All right, my number two. Forrest Gump. That's my that number two, too. So almost on I my list. I shit you not. That's are you my number two. <laughs> oh it's my, my number two. This is like fucking mind blowing. Like, you all. Oh, wow. 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 What is. Okay. 
I mean, I'm going to talk about it for a second here, but Forrest Gump. Here's I my, mean, my number one and my number two, just to show you. Forrest Gump and then Purple I, I knew Rain. Purple, yeah, I knew Purple Rain was going to be your number one, actually. But, um, dude, That's Forrest too funny, Gump, that man. whole soundtrack, that yeah. whole soundtrack. I mean, it fits. It, it, it fits so well. They picked, like, the perfect songs for this movie. Uh, I, it's amazing. Uh, amazing soundtrack. I would buy just the soundtrack just to put in my, you know, just put it in the vehicle and just, just ride. put it on the first song. Yeah. Just let it play through when you're doing some spring cleaning or whatever. <laughs> yep. Yeah. All right, Carrie, what's your number two? My number two is The Bodyguard. The bodyguard. You know what? I will and always I... love you. E.I. Well, always e. love you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. E.I. Well, well, always. <laughs> Dude, award-winning song. I, I, I can't guess. hate. I can't hate. No. And, and, and Felix, yours was not. Yours was Forrest Gump. So my number two, my number one. I'm gonna since I already let him out. Forrest mm -hmm. Gump. We know why. And Purple Rain. I mean, Prince. Mm -hmm. What, Purple I, what can Rain. I say, man? That whole, I, I know every single song in that uh, whole soundtrack, top of my head. Uh, grew up watching that movie. Um, Prince uh, is my favorite artist of all time. So uh, I, can't, I, I knew I couldn't go wrong with it. So it's proper room. Mm -hmm. Well, I'm going kind of off the rails here with number my number one. Uh, when I hear this soundtrack, I just like want to get up and just start working out or just run. My number one Footloose. is Mortal Kombat. Oh. Mortal Kombat. Mortal Kombat. Footloose. Yeah. <laughs> and, and they made it like the, the, I mean, yeah, I mean, it's totally techno. Uh, which is not normally my thing, but I love the whole soundtrack to Mortal Kombat. I I actually used to have that on CD as well um, back in the day before all these MP3s and stuff. That, that's that's cool. a good soundtrack to work out with, especially. Oh, it, if you don't get pumped up listening to that soundtrack, your heart is cold. Yeah. <laughs> all right, Carrie, how about your, what is your number one? My number one <laughs> is not Ponyo. Kevin, what do you think it is? Oh, you! Oh my God! You're not gonna guess it. I know this. I'm, I'm gonna. Sure. No. I'm gonna. Superman. No. My number one is Selena. You can't hate Dreaming that. of you. That that movie and that soundtrack. Whew. That is totally like a tearjerker for me. J Lo. I think the whole the whole situation and like the whole movie and what like happened? her life had mm -hmm. to play in with me choosing that as my number one. So I gotcha. I gotcha. You chose it for the emotional aspect of it. Yes. I gotcha. And of course, since uh, I was gonna do a uh, honorable mention, but since I had to show off that me, you know, I, I was in line about Kevin, but. I mean, there's uh, oh, these there's are just sim right there, man. simple songs from movies that I just, girl, you'll be a woman soon from Pulp Fiction, uh, Cocktail Kokomo. There's a place called Kokomo. Coco. Wow. <laughs> uh, this, this one's a musical. <laughs> Music. It's Duel of the Fates. It's Star Wars. Listen, I, I listen to it when I'm editing this shit. Duel of the Fates, <laughs> Don't You Forget About Me, Breakfast Club, Lose Yourself, Eminem, Eight mm -hmm. Mile, Danger Zone, Top Gun. You know, when you're yeah. on the freeway and that song comes on, you go over the speed limit. You know you do. Oh, yeah. Top Gun Top Gun was on and off my list like three different times. Yes. I, I just couldn't make put it on there. And then Footloose was actually on and off my list a couple times, too. But it's in my... It, it's well, there's so many maybe. to choose from. It's just hard yeah. to choose five. And right, I'm just yeah. keeping mine. Be honest, when I'm we shocked did, that we were similar. Yeah, I'm very shocked that we're similar. Very. 
All right, guys. Now we're going to move on to the new December fan franchises. Yes. All right, check it out. December's Horror, Horror Guild, Ash versus Evil Dead, Santa Slay, like Slay. Mm -hmm. Uh, He'll have eyes in Silent Night, Deadly Night, thus. Uh, Carrie, what's what's on? What's going to be in the Gamer Guild? Gamer is Cyberpunk, Sonic the Hedgehog, God of War, and Fallout. For Geek, for the Geek Guild, hashtag Geek Guild, everybody, right here, hashtag Geek Guild. We have Ernest Saves Christmas, which I'm a big fan of all the Ernest movies. Yes, Bad Santa, <laughs> love that movie. I'm not, yeah, I'm not going to get into the scene. Uh, then we got Star Avengers Endgame and Star Wars. For anime, there's what, Carrie? My Hero Academia. And mm-hmm. Cowboy Bebop. And Assassination Classroom. And more. And more. And must. Now comes the part of the show where we answer questions from uh, our previous video. Remember... If we answer your question live on camera, you get entered in for a full free art upgrade. Carrie, what comes in a full free art upgrade? Free full art upgrade. You will get the regular pin, the 250 pin, the 99 pin, and the regular art print and the out of 500 art print. Awesome, awesome, awesome. So we really only got one question from our last video. Folks. We get at the end of every month, we get all the questions, throw them in a, a red vines bucket, and you'll win. It's that easy. Our question comes from Lake and Spencer. What's up, Lake and hey, Lake and Spencer? He asked, Do you think there will be a four box pin set now that we've added the anime box? Not right I away. I believe that that is a possible, yeah, it's a possibility, though. It's possible. It's possible we would have Bam would have to figure out a way to make it fit. Um, it was pretty hard I, coming up. With I would the, love uh, to see it. Yeah, yeah, I would love. Yeah, to see I it. don't think that there's like an anime that goes along with geek and horror. I don't know, but maybe it, it, there it, is one. It's possible. It would, my guess is it would have to be something kind of like um, the the Treehouse of Horror from the October box. To right. where it would have to be like a theme. You can now reach us on Twitch and Facebook. Where, Kevin? The Mod Squad Network. There you go. Oh, yeah. Holla at the network. <laughs> All right. Uh, I do believe that concludes this episode of the Mod Squad. So, for Carrie and Felix. I'm Kevin saying, keep on bamming, bammers. Hey, Golden. I knew this girl named Nikki. I guess you could say she was a sex fiend. You can now follow us on Facebook and Twitch. Carrie? Mm-hmm. Yes. You can now reach us on Twitch and Facebook at Carrie? The Mod Squad Experience. You can now reach us on Twitch and Facebook on Carrie? The Mod Squad Experience. I met her in a hotel lobby, masturbating with a magazine. Carrie, what comes in a full free art upgrade? You will get the fucking... (laughs) (laughs) Okay. Free art upgrade. You will receive the... You will get in the free full fright. Uh, <laughs> okay. 
in the in the she said how'd you like to waste some time and i could not resist when i saw little nikki grind wait was that wrong <laughs> 